Hey you guys, it's Teresa here with the Narc Remedy and today's topic is going to be about what is the first thing that narcissists find attractive about their partner? But before we jump into the topic, I want you guys to like, comment, and subscribe, share the video you guys, share, share, share the video so we can grow, and also put your notification bells on so you guys can be notified every time I post new content like this. Let's begin. Okay, so you guys, what is the first thing that narcissists will find attractive by their partner? This may sound creepy, but the first thing narcissists notice about you is what you lack. Yes. Namely, the lack of boundaries. That's what closes the deal. That's why I tell you guys, take a break from dating so you guys can figure out what you're lacking so you can fill that void before you jump out and date another person. Now, what is boundaries? Boundaries are limits and rules that you set in place so nobody won't violate you or disrespect you. Now, in the love bombing stage, you guys, narcissists will ask you all kinds of questions to figure out what your weaknesses are and what are your childhood traumas and why you are so open to them so easily and so early. Now for a lack of boundaries, I would say um, allowing somebody to call you or text you at 3 a.m. when you just met them or letting somebody call you babe and you don't even know them or letting somebody move in with you early or letting somebody touch you without permission. If the narcissist does any of these things or more, just know you have opened the door to them. They will take advantage of you. If they see that you're so open and you're so willing to go along with them calling you at 3 a.m., they're going to keep doing it because you allow it. Okay. If they see that you're letting them touch you without permission, like on your butt or on your arm or something, and you're not saying anything too much, you're just laughing it off. They're going to keep doing it because you're allowing that behavior. They love your lack of boundaries. Then they get to the rest of the checklist of what they find attractive about you. Some of the things that narcissists find attractive about you at first, you being self-sufficient, you being attractive physically, you being likable, you being loving, you being successful. Now, all of these things, you guys, is going to benefit them in some type of way if they're with you. Now, the things that narcissists hate about you a little later is all of the things that I just said they found attractive at first. They'd be attracted to all those things at first and then they hate you for those very same things. Crazy, right? But yeah, you guys, that is the first thing that narcissists find attractive in their partners. What you lack. Mostly your lack of boundaries. If they see you have no healthy boundaries in place, oh, it's a go for them. That closes the deal. They know they can manipulate you gaslight you, lie to you, cheat on you, use you up, and you're going to allow it. You're going to take it. Because they know from the beginning, from talking to you, they know they can run all over you. And that's where the BS starts. So remember, you guys, you got to set healthy boundaries. Learn how to say no to people. That'll be a start because people don't like to hear no. But once you put those healthy boundaries in place and say, hey, I don't like for people to touch me without permission. I don't like for people to call me babe and I don't know them. I don't like for people to call and text me at wee hours of the night, 3 a.m. in the morning. I don't allow that. You have to come out and say it, you guys. I don't allow that. I don't accept that. 
And if they're a narcissist or a toxic person, watch how fast they run from you. Narcissists don't like boundaries. They run from that. So if you guys like this video, please be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Share the video, you guys, so we can grow. And also, put your notification bells on so you guys can be notified every time I post new content like this. Bye, you guys.